Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Nasa Super Fan. Right now, I'm just going to give a talk real quick about the Black Panther trailer that just came out. Because right now, some people don't understand why certain black YouTubers or if you're a person of certain skin color are acting the way they are towards the Black Panther character. This character has history. Not only that he's the first black superhero, um, but it's just the way this character was portrayed. You know, he's not... It, like any other character, you know, that answers to uh, anybody, you know, like, you know, you have Jon Stewart, you have Nick uh, Nick Fury, you have uh, uh, the Falcon, you have Black Lightning, um, or uh, Luke, C Luke Cage, uh, basically all these other, uh, Cyborg, Steel, all these other black characters that are featured. Basically, these characters are, I would say, African American superhero. Then you have Black Panther, which is a black superhero, but he's an African hero. You know, he he is his own character. Now he's a king. He's one of the richest character in the Marvel universe, uh, and he's also, like I said before, one of the first black superhero character. And it means a lot to have one of, a character like that. You know, because. You know you have Tony Stark, you know, but you don't have too many character, too many black superhero characters that are at that caliber. And T'Challa, aka Black Panther, is one of those characters that, you know, I'm really hoping they do the character justice when it comes out. Cause he is one of the great. Um, he was basically sidelined for a while now, you know, and he. And this character, he deserved to have a good movie. He deserved to come out. And what I'm hoping when this movie comes out that you don't... Uh, I know because for a fact, I know there's going to be people that's going to, you know, going to be out there, especially in the news. Uh, I'm going to say Fox News. Fox News. They, I know there's going to be a story that probably they're going to talk about how, oh, the Black Panther character is very offensive. But the, when this character came out, he, I know he was fe uh, also features in the... All black comic book. Uh, uh, pu he was published with all black comic book, and there was a story with him fighting the clan and all that. So, this character means a lot. Like, means a lot to the black community. And also, when when he came out, just uh, before he became Black Panther, I know they tried to call him um, Black Leopard and all that because they didn't want to offend the Black Panther movement, but. I'm glad they went the route they did with him, especially with the costume they did, because his costume was originally going to be, like, um, basically um, orange with stripes and stuff, so very glad they went this route with his character, but along the line of that, it's just very, I'm very proud to see a character like that, because, um, you know, don't, you, you could say we had um, Blade, but this is different compared to Blade, you know? Um, it's just... I don't, I don't think anybody's gonna understand how uh, a black person or any person of mixed color, mixed or not, gonna feel about it. Having a character like that portrayed in the big screen, you know? Somebody confident, black, you know, don't take no from nobody. Just straight up badass superhero come to the big screen and I'm hoping this movie do, does good at, at the box office you know and if you guys don't know about Black Panther please there's plenty of comic out there like to read about him because he is one of those characters that, like I said before that they, they sideline side him and he has great story especially um right now with the uh, um um the new uh, uh, Marvel story. Let me see if, if I have a... Uh, put out the box real quick. Let me see if I have a... What is comic in here? You see? You see? I have so much comic. Uh, yeah, I look through this collection, but... I was trying to... What I was trying to do is show you guys... Uh, one of those comics that I have. I have plenty of comic when it comes to Black Panther, but I was trying to show you a, a good read to start off. If you don't want to go as far, because I know they restarted uh, with an all new different Marvel. They started the whole Black Panther story all over again. 
Yeah, that was my boy. He he's also a Black Panther fan, so yeah. But oh man, I gotta. Uh, here we go. Marvel's all the way in the back. Here we go. Uh, yeah. Look at this beauty right here. Issue one, number one. Guys, if you, if you have a comic book store close by, please go by and check out this issue right here. I have the rest of the issue in my other boxes somewhere, but please check him out. Black Panther. He is a character to, worth reading about. Um, and he is a badass. He's part of the Illuminati. It's just ridiculous how this character, I don't know why. He, he like, he was, it's like, for, for me, personally, having this movie with him is basically making up for all the time they put him in the sign. Like, he's, he's basically being put in the front line right now, you know? And this is, matter of fact, it's not all about him. This movie has been directed, he, is being directed by a black director with an all black cast and I don't know how DC is gonna answer to that but right now Marvel is with this this what they doing right now with this all black cast is crazy and once again I know this movie is gonna be controversial I know for a fact somebody's gonna make this movie controversial and they're gonna bring that shit up which is ridiculous you know it's it's not it's it, it, you just gotta understand this is history in the making you know there's no need to make it controversial you can't have you can't make a black panther movie with half of the tribe white you know but i'm not gonna go into detail with that i'm just very happy and proud to have to be alive you know to be able to have go to the movie and show my kid that hey look we have a black panther movie coming out and I'm gonna bring you to it. You know, I'm, I'm just happy and glad to be alive to be able to see this movie myself. You know, and we ha this movie has a great cast. You know, um, beside the director Ryan Cooper, we we have Chadwick Boseman, Michael B. Jordan, um, Lupita, uh, Lupita uh, Nyong'o, um, uh, what's the, uh, Angela Bassett, um, Forrest Whitaker. It's just crazy this cast. You know, and it's it's not it's not. B list it's just A list class black actor. You know, uh, Denai Guerrero, aka um, Michonne from The Walking Dead. Uh, Daniel Kula, uh, you guys might know him from uh, Get Out. Um, is uh, very excited to see this movie. Um, I know if, if it doesn't, I don't want, I don't want you guys, if you're a white, black, Hispanic fan, or uh, subscriber to my channel, to think this is all about uh, black movie you know it's not about that you know it's just history in the making and us i'm not i'm gonna speak for myself and or anybody else who's very proud of this movie it just makes us pride in it i want everybody to be part of this history just like we were part of making wonder woman history when this movie come out i don't want nobody to be all controversial about it, to be hesitant to go watch it just go watch it because i know it's gonna be good i know it's not good i don't want nobody to feel excluded just because it's weird this side, you know, uh, certain people feel excited about. Them. Don't feel excluded, you know, just because if you're white, black, I mean, if you're white, Hispanic, or not, any other creed, don't feel secluded from this. It's just, it's part of history, you know? If you're a comic book fan, movie fan, go watch it. Don't feel excluded just because us, uh, us black people are very proud of this movie. Don't feel like you're gonna be excluded from this. You are part of this, you know? This is history in the making. And again, I'm gonna say it again. I know for a fact when this the uh, next year, when this movie comes out, it's gonna there's gonna be a lot of buzz around it. And I know for it's gonna be Fox News, just like they did with Wonder Woman with the whole patriotic thing. They're gonna bring something up about Black Panther. Somebody is either gonna be Fox News or somebody in the internet gonna post some bullshit about how this is all about black power and all that which is total bullshit but once again i am very proud for this movie and i'm i can't wait for it to come out and black panther yeah can't wait thank you guys for watching 
don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and thank you for listening to me rambling about black panther and like i said before don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and i will be seeing y'all soon